ear in November filming start Warner Brothers' latest The Batman update sees Warner Brothers. And DC's highly anticipated standalone movie is reportedly looking to start filming in November 2019. This contradicts a report from late last year that speculated that would start filming in summer 2019. But given the erratic nature of the film's development up to this point, it certainly wouldn't be surprising if Warner Bros. pushed the filming start date back again. Previously expected to be directed and starring Ben Affleck, who played the Caped Crusader in both Batman v Superman, Dawn of Justice and Justice League. The actor, director eventually stepped down from helming solo movie, ultimately replaced by director Matt Reeves, War for the Planet of the Apes, who would also rewrite the script. While Reeves was expected to turn in his latest draft for by the end of last year, there's still no word on who will don the cowl in his film. The continuing rumor is that Reeves wants someone younger for the role, but that's not confirmed. If the most recent report of S filming start date is correct, Reeves will likely be looking to fill out his cast sooner rather than later. According to THR's Heat Vision newsletter, could start filming as early as November 2019. The same report suggests that Reeves met his script deadline as well, though he will continue to work on it as the filming date approaches. Or Reeves have confirmed this information. It's important to keep in mind that neither Warner Brothers. If this turns out to be correct, it might be a bit disappointing for certain fans who were hoping the summer date was more in line with when the Batman would start filming. This could potentially be out of Reeves' hand though considering the large amount of Tse films slated to release over the coming months. Especially considering how successful both Wonder Woman and Aquaman have been and continue to be at the box office. Perhaps it's smart for the studio to continue focusing on standalone films of lesser-known characters. Still, considering how much money Nolan's Dark Knight trilogy earned, with the latter two films both crossing the billion-dollar mark at the worldwide box office, it's only a matter of time before Eves sees the light of day. Whether that's with a full egg in the role or someone else entirely remains to be seen, but Reeves has proven himself more than capable of handling big-budget films in the past. Has definitely left the film in capable hands. So Warner Brothers. Source, DHR.